يعطيكم العافية. This is just a, a part of the lecture that was missing, uh, missing in your uh, playlist. So this will be, uh, I, I have uh, updated the playlist, so it can be in order, and I will uh, update the titles. So the numbering would be, uh, would reflect the correct uh, lecture uh, numbers. Uh, so this will be just until slide 36, and then everything else will be available in the playlist. Uh, Bismillah ar-Rahman rahim So this is uh, just to begin about the types of chromosome abnormalities. If you recall, we talked we talked uh, slightly about the numerical problems with the uh, chromosomes. That is aneuploidy, which is the abnormal number of chromosomes, either an ad an addition of a, cro a chromosome or a loss of a chromosome. Uh, so you can have a monosomy, which is uh, losing one chromosome, trisomy, uh, a duplication of one chromosome, tetrasomy, teratim in chromosome idafiyin. A polyploidy is an abnormal number of sets of chromosomes. So the entire sets of the 23 chromosomes is duplicated once more. So but then we two n, you will have three n or four n. So this is triploidy, haploid plus diploid gametes, or tetraploidy, which is two diploids. So these are the numerical problems that can happen with the chromosomes. Now the structural problems. The translocations, the inversions, the insertions, the deletions, the rings, the duplications, and the duplicate arms as in isochromosomes. So we recall haploid is n, diploid is 2n, euploid is the exact number of multiples of n. So numerical chromosomal abnormalities is changes in the, no in the number of chromosomes. So polyploidies, as we mentioned, is a somatic cells contain multiple of haploid number of chromosomes. The 3N, 4N, and the true of germ cell tumors in certain types of germ cell tumors. Some of them, I think, Allahumma um, sallam says Ahmed. So a, a complete mole or a partial mole. A partial mole would have, uh, would have probably these kind of uh, uh, duplicates. Uh, aneuploidy, heteroploidy. So uh, this is what we were saying, deviation from the diploid number of chromosomes. So you can 2n plus 1, but then 47, 2n minus 1, 45, and uh, so on. Mechanism of polyploidy, we touched on this uh, meiotic non disjunction, so we will we'll go over it uh, a bit more. Uh, failure of pulling apart of two chromatids to opposite ends after uh, metaphase stage of mitosis. So this is the reduplication of chromosomes without dissolving the nuclear membrane. So this is a failure of cytoplasmic division. So uh, polyploidy, like we said here, uh, triploidy, tetraploidy, so aneuploidy would be monosomic, which is like Turner syndrome, X, XO, 45 XO, so have a missing one sex chromosome or X chromosome. Uh, trisomic, like Down syndrome, methanum, uh, Edward syndrome, methanum, uh, the, the trisomic here, 2N plus 1, who can have chromosome 21. We have an addition of another chromosome 21, so we have a, a Down syndrome, tetrasomic, methanum. 2n plus 2, so مثلا 48xxxx, uh, so uh, quadruple x, this is a tetrasomic aneuploidy. And nullsomic, which is 2n uh, minus 2, so you have lost uh, an entirety of a chromosome. Uh, so aberrant euploidy, polyploidy, so these are the tri triploidy, so this is what would happen is. Uh, this is what we were talking about in the in the partial mole, probably. So you have a um, an egg that is fertilized by two sperm. So you have three sets of ends, or you can have a duplicated uh, set already abnormally inside a, 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 an ovum that becomes fertilized, and then or you have a duplicate inside the sperm which uh, fertilizes a normal egg. So you'll have at the, at the three sets in here. This is, these are the mechanisms of triploidy. Tetraploidy is, is a bit more rare. So you would have to have uh, tetraploidy inside uh, one of the ovum, and then it duplicates all of its sets again. And then you have, uh, without cell division, and you would have 4N in, in the uh, ovum, or the, yeah, on the ovum. So triploidy, all chromosomes, uh, three, Threefold. This is what we just said. Uh, the rarely occurs in human, although it occurs in some tissue, especially in the liver, as it is constantly regenerating tissue. And I mentioned about the um, 
the uh, partial mole that can happen. This is a type of germ cell tumor. Uh, the mom. Uh, triploid syndrome. So this is one of them. Either the sperm or the egg has two full sets of chromosomes leading to a triploid baby. In humans, triploid babies will either miscarry or die within the first year of life. Now this is meiotic non-disjunction which we uh, touched upon. So this, mis this may involve autosomes or sex chromosomes. Any chromosome can uh, have a meiotic non-disjunction. So in females incidence increase with age above age 35. This is and the most common meiotic non-disjunction chromosome is chromosome 21. So that's why women over the age of 35 are a lot more prone to having Babies with Down syndrome, as Down syndrome or, or, or trisomy 21 is the most common meiotic non-disjunction. Now, meiosis 1, two members of homologous chromosomes fail to separate and both members of, of a pair of, uh, move to, into one cell. Or meiosis 2, when mean sister chromatids fail to separate. This is what we mentioned in the last lecture in cytogenetics. So again, let's go over this one. This is a really nice uh, slide. So. If it happens in meiosis 1, you have the first d division, one chromosome uh, did not uh, normally like this, so it did not have uh, separating the two, the, the two duplicate chromosomes, or the, two, the 4n into 2n and 2n. So what happens is you have 4n in one uh, cell and 0n in one cell for that specific chromosome, can have the chromosome 21. So you have duplicates here of chromosome 21 with two chromatids and then in the second meiosis, you, you remove each chromatid by itself, and then you have, uh, here you end up with two chromosomes 21, here two chromosomes 21, here zero chromosomes 21, this is zero chromosomes 21. Now, you get a full set from the father, let's say from the father, so now you have 45 chromosomes here because you are missing one 21, or you have 47 chromosomes here because now... Uh, you have an addition, additional uh, chromosome 21. So this is, will be these two cells in from meiotic non-disjunction in first meiosis will have will will either give you no normal cells at all. None, no, none of the gametes will be normal. So you will either have 50% monosomic cells or 50% trisomic cells. Now uh, a second meiotic division or meiosis 2. If if this happens in meiosis 2, so you had the 4n. You duplicated it into N to N, and then at the second meiosis, you had th the same non disjunction occur. You will have 50% of the cells because of the first meiosis, these cells will be normal, and the other 50%, half of them will be monosomic and half of them will be trisomic. Uh, nothing new here, I think. Causes of non disjunctions, aging effect. On, of the, on the primary oocyte, this is um, a bigger problem here. Radiation, so women who have had some, some sort of radiation. Uh, delayed fertilization after ovulation, so the longer that the egg has to wait for the sperm, the more likely that it, a non-destruction uh, would occur, and the effects are either, like we said, a monosomy or trisomy. A mechanism of aneuploidy, non-destruction, failure of separation of chromosomes during cell division, formation of two types of, uh, of gametes, uh, mitotic non-disjunction, this is a mosaism. So some cells have abnormal chromosomal uh, numbers and others have normal. Occurs in the earliest cell divisions after fertilization. And affected individuals exhibit characteristic not all of a particular syndrome. مثلاً, for example, Down syndrome among percent of cases. What is this? Let's see that this is mitotic non-disjunction. So the egg, let's go to the this happened here. So you had a normal gamete, and the, the normal gamete has been uh, fertilized. And then now it is divi dividing, dividing, dividing. Now it's dividing by what? Meiosis or mitosis? After this point of fertilization, it will be divided by mitosis. Now you might have non disjunction in one of the cells while it is duplicating. So it's duplicating by mitosis. He added the cell chromosome. قاعدة بتفصل الكروموسومات مثلا من واحد ل 23 وصلت ل 21 راحت حطت اثنين بخلية وصفر بخلية وكملت هلا كل خلينا نحكي ابناء هاي الخلية لانه احكي انت بتحكي مثلا بالبداية في البلاستوسيست سو so خلينا نحكي مثلا كان في عندك 32 خلية وال 24 خلية ولا مثلا 1000 خلية بس هو البيبي لما ينتهي عنده مليارات الخلايا رايت right? 
So all the children of that cell that had had mitotic non-disjunction would exhibit trisomy, مثلا, or monosomy, right? So the baby, مثلا, إذا خلينا نحكي مثلا على 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 the division where he had a thousand cells. One of the cells had mitotic non-disjunction. The baby had. When he finishes, one out of one thousand cells in his body have Down syndrome. Nine hundred and ninety-nine will have normal cell, normal cells. If he has, for example, he has four hundred and sixteen cells. For example, one out of sixty-four cells are Down syndrome, and one out of sixty-three and sixty-three cells are normal. And so this is called mosaicism. المزايك تعرفوها هاي بكون كانوا مثلا بالزمان بالمعابد ببنوها افتحوا على جوجل شوفوها المزايك مثلا هذول صور بكون معمولة من من مربعات ملونة مثلا ألوان أحمر وأخضر وأصفر وبيعمل منها صورة مربعات صغيرة صغيرة زي بيكسلز بالصور فبيعمل منها صور بتشوفوها مثلا بخلي بشو اسمه هاي كنيسة المهد عندنا بالهون حاطينها فيها في مزايك حلو في كثير مزايك كانوا بيعملوها قبل هذا كمان but this is called mosaicism so ما ما تلاقي مثلا إنه كنا الأحمر هذا كله أو مثلا شو مثلا مثلا بسة بتلاقي بسة لونها أبيض وعليها شوية هيك أسود. This is this can be looked at as mosaicism. هذا الأسود مثلا إنهم أولاد خلية صار فيها شوية mutation فصار في عندهم كل هدول الأولاد هالخلية أسود. ف this is kind of mosaicism, right? So this is mosaicism. This is happens in in, in mitotic uh, non-disjunction. Uh, so, uh, myotic non-disjunction generates uh, generates aneuploidies, like we mentioned. So, disomic here, trisomic in, in, in first and second. So, there is nothing here that is new. Uh, yeah, this is the one that we mentioned. Uh, distribution of non-disjunction. So, maternal, uh, meiosis 1, 21, chromosome 21, 15, 16 are very uh, common. Paternal are none. In meiosis 2, a chromosome 18 is very common for uh, the mothers and the father 18 and 21 mitosis 15 18 21 and 8 for the mother's side and 18 and 21 for the father's side uh, genetic diversity crossing over in uh, meiosis 1 swap pieces of dna independent and these are present in the uh, supplementary material that were sent as well uh, somatic chromosomal uh, abnormalities. So numerical chromosomal disorders, uh, general features. So this uh, loss produces more severe symptoms. Loss of a, of a chromosome or part of the chromosome will, will have more severe symptoms than a gain of chromosomal material. Imbalance of sex chromosomes are tolerated better than imbalanced autosomes. But الاختلافات بال sex chromosomes تستحملهم أكثر الجسم من اختلافات بال autosomes اللي هم من واحد اثنين وعشرين. Sometimes manifested only at adolescence and in most cases result from de novo changes. And then uh, we have a mutation in the gametes and then you have these numerical uh, disorders. Uh, Down syndrome. So this is a growth uh, failure and I think a lot of you are, uh, have, have at least met someone with Down syndrome or know someone with Down syndrome. And this is a very common and one of the most or the most common uh, uh, Type of chromosomal disorders. So uh, you have uh, many uh, problems, methan growth failure, mental retardation, uh, broad uh, flat face, slanting eyes. This is very common. Hippocampic eye folds. Um, it's not present. I think we'll get to it. Uh, congenital heart disease is very common. Uh, a diminished muscle tone. Uh, it improves a little bit over time. A small and a small and arched palate. Big wrinkled tongue. Uh, dental anomalies. Uh, short and broad hands. Uh, hey, you have uh, many loops on the fingers, tips, palm crease. Had uh, they very common. Uh, flat back of the head. Uh, so this is trisomy 21 uh, occurs in all populations approximately in the same rate فكل ال يعني اوروبيين افارقه اسيويين كلهم نفس ال age يعني has the same uh, incidence because it's it's just a problem with with chromosomes being duplicated so um, so in less than 25 years of age one out of 1600 births 30 to 34 one out of 800 double 
and over 41 out of 80, 10 times uh, more. Uh, causes of chromosomal aberrations in trisomy 21, so meiotic non-disjunction is probably, this is obviously the most common, 95%, and balanced translocation, this can happen about 41%, 4% uh, 4, 4 up one, uh, between 21 and uh, between chromosomes 13, 14, and 15, so we have an addition part or additional part of 21 present on uh, these chromosomes, so you have sort of a small uh, the full set and then you have an additional part of chromosome 21 so it, it behaves slightly like trisomy 21 about in mitotic non-destruction about 1% uh, so 46 uh, this is the I21Q recurrence risk is, is, is low translocation 1421 uh, as well uh, Okay, so this is the this is the خلينا هاي نحكي عنها هلا شوية. So these are uh, the chromosomal involvement in translocation in familial Down syndrome. So this is a familial case of Down syndrome that keep is not de novo. It keeps happening in the same family over and over and over. The photograph هلا هون shows the uh, relevant chromosome from a trisomy 21 offspring produced by a translocation carrier parent. شو بصير? So this is the normal uh, parent. And the 14 21. You take one of each, and then you have a, a nice gamete here. Now, in a familial case, you have a translocation. Hayyohona. This is you have one normal chromosome 21, and the other chromosome 21 is bound or fused with a part of chromosome 14. So instead of having this is a translocation carrier or 1421. So you have a, a loss of a chromosome, but actually two chromosomes have fused and have lost part of their material. So the normal chromosome 14, and this is fine. But then you have a monosomic lethal because you, you don't have the other part of the chromosome 21. And then this is this would be lethal. They will not have children here. So where you might have children. Now, if you happen to have take this part of this chromosome with this chromosome, you will have a normal gamete and everything normal. So one out of three of the children that can be born are normal. Now, the, what is left is you you would have either this chromosome twenty one with the abnormal chromosome. Uh, the fused chromosome. So now you will have trisomy Down syndrome here. This will definitely be Down syndrome because you have one, two, and three chromosome 21s, and then you have two chromosomes 14s. But this is still a trisomy 21, and this this is a Down syndrome. Now, what happens if you take this one as chromosome 21 and 14? So you will end up with the same as the father. This will be another carrier or the mother or whatever, right? So that this is the familial case of Down syndrome. Uh, let me double check. Hold on. Okay. So uh, trisomy 13, uh, Patau syndrome, uh, described by these guys, uh, chromosomal complement, uh, 47XX plus 13 female or 47XX plus 13 male, XY, right? So it's, 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 it's trisomy 13. Male or female incidence about 1 in 12,000 increases with maternal age as well. You again will have mental deficiency, low birth weight, uh, absence, absence of the corpus callosum in the brain, uh, hypoplasia of the cerebellum, sloping forehead, scalp defects, uh, polydactyl, uh, malformed ears, congenital heart defects, uh, renal tract anomalies, microphthalmia. Uh, so this is this is what it looks like. Uh, clenched hands with overlapping fingers. This is common at birth. For the crease in the Down syndrome and, and, and this one in, in Patau. Cleft palate, small mouth, small jaw, short neck. Um, okay. Now Edward syndrome. This is uh, mental deficiency, growth retardation, prominent occiput, uh, webbing of the neck clinched fist with overlapping with the fingers. So uh, this is a trisomy 18, Edwards. One in 7,500 births. Um, again, um, the same, yani. 
very similar to the previous one. Okay. Now monosomy is uh, one uh, representative of chromosomes is present and non disjunction. Here one cell ends up with one copy. In me, the monosomic, I can have a sort of one issue. Uh, and a face lag, uh, all chromosomes fail to move into the new daughter cells, and all complete autosomal uh, monosomies are uh, lethal. You can't live, you know, it's more severe if you lose a chromosome. Now, sex chromosomes abnormalities. Now, this, in, the same problems that can happen with autosomes can happen with uh, sex chromosomes. Now, sex chromosomes aneuploidy is more common than autosome aneuploidy, hatta il huwa mawjood bil down, right? In order to survive and develop, embryo needs at least one X chromosome. So in healthy female, one X chromosomes will be inactivated, had whole bar body, as you remember. And an individual who has an intact Y chromosome will be male, regardless of the number of X chromosomes that they, they have. In the absence of an intact Y chromosome, the individual will be female. Now, X chromosomal disorders, imbalances of X chromosomes are better tolerated than those of autosomes. Increased number of X chromosomes in either males or females add a need to uh, mental uh, defects. Unization, uh, Mary Leon, uh, during the 16th day of embryonic life, one X chromosome female is randomly inactivated, and then this happened to persist in all the daughter cells of that cell. So, a woman with chromosome constitution 47 uh, triple X should have two bar bodies. So this is one way you can uh, look at it here, Matana. Or a 48 XY male and the two bar bodies. So this definitely he has definitely 48. So this is the number of bar bodies tells you how many additional X chromosomes you have. So uh, a 45 X will not have a bar body, or a 46 XY male will not have a bar body. A normal female will have one bar body. A male who has an extra X chromosome, XXY, will have one bar body. Okay, variation in chromosome numbers. An organism with one complete set of chromosomes is said to be euploid. And euploidy variation in the number of individual chromosomes, non disjunction during meiosis 1. So this happens again. But instead, here we were talking about sex chromosomes. Now these may not be lethal because uh, if you happen to fertilize this with a sperm that has X, so this would be XO, XO and it'll be Turner. If this happens to be with a mate with a Y, this would be XXXXXY, or another one with another X would be triple X, and so on. So a normal here, these are the normals. This will always be Turner or triple X. Uh, again, this will be. Uh, meiotic one, meiotic two. So in meiotic one, meiosis one, F one, you will always have either Turner or uh, triple X, or uh, here you will either either have in meiosis two, you will either have half of them normal, or half or a quarter with Turner or a quarter with triple X. So. How did I get that for you? So, um, um, yeah, that's, that's, that's what we just said. Let's just go over it again. So you have uh, in meiosis 1, this will, in meiosis 1, everybody will be abnormal. So what happens if this is in two Xs? So you will have, you, if, if the, if the uh, sperm is carrying a Y chromosome and you happen to have two Xs, so this is XXY, it's called Klein filter. بطعميل هذا بكون عندهم مثلا النيبلز بعاد عن بعض بكون عندهم مايكرو بينس بكون عندهم فيري سمول تيستيكلز يعني هلا بنحكي عنها تمام سو ذيس از كلاين فلتر هذول اذا اخذوا واي ما عندهم اكس طبعا ليثل حكينا ايش ما عندك اكس راح تكون ليثل سو ذيس ذيس از ذيس از ذا كيس ناو اذا 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 سبيرم هاز ان اكس هون راح يكون تريبل اكس هون راح يكون تريبل اكس هون راح يكون تيرنر هون راح يكون تيرنر now, if it happens in meiosis 2, now the same issue as, as you said, half of them would be normal, so either normal males or normal females, or then the same picture here, but in half. Yeah, and cut it in half, so you have a quarter lethal, a quarter client filter with a Y-bearing sperm, or triple X, an or Turner with a X-bearing sperm. Uh, this is uh, Turner syndrome, so you have these 
uh, a lot of them have um, are infertile, have heart problems, uh, poor breast development, uh, web neck web neck uh, a fold of the skin, constriction of the aorta. Um, they may have these like brown spots on the on the on the skin. Right, so phenotypically they are female with short, swelling, broad chest, web neck, lots, low set ears. A sterile, they can't have kids, but with IVF you can they can have kids. Uh, you can harvest uh, uh, ovum or some eggs from them, and then you can uh, fertilize them, and then their uterus can harbor a fertilized blastocyst. Heart defects are um, About 60% are, are, are the classic 45XO. Mosaic forms, about 30%. 30 and other forms, about 14%. Now, the client filter, this is the client filter is male. عنده واي وراح يكون ميل فحكينا as we mentioned low is small testicles testicular atrophy feminized habitus so has more estradiol in their body so gynecomastia they're tall slim uh, have high FSH at the H ليش لأنه ما عندهم enough production of testosterone to to do the feedback inhibition so caused by meiotic non disjunction common cause of male hypogonadism Testicular atrophy, infertility, azospermia, female distribution of hair, long limb, narrow shoulders, gynecomastia. Uh, karyotype, uh, 47XXY, uh, about 82%, and then in mosaics, about uh, 15%. Uh, can they have children? Yes, IVF, but you have to do surgery on the on uh, testicles to retrieve viable sperm. Uh, by intracytoplasmic sperm inoculation, more than 60 children born to client filter patients. Uh, testicular abnormal does not develop before puberty. Uh, mental retardation is unusual, but IQ may be low, below normal, slightly below normal. This is one way that they can be caught early. Uh, 47XYY, أي إشي إضافة بالY will always uh, will will have uh, lower IQ uh, scores and they will become more attention deficit, more hyperactive and more uh, impulsive and slightly more aggressive even. So not obviously abnormal, not being in abnormal. Spokun يعني زي ما حكينا has all these uh, problems. Tall, fertile, may have several acne, severe acne during adolescence, uh, and obviously more problems with education and behavior. Uh, sex chromosome tetrasomy, males with XXXY, so obviously they would be males. If you have a Y, you're a male. Reduction in intellectual raccoon actor actor, no, the more X chromosomes, the, the more have you have problems with the uh, more than normal, uh, you have more uh, problems. So we have gonadal hypoplasia, it's very common. As a rule, additional X chromosomes cause more abnormal phenotype, more defective sexual development, and mental impairment. Uh, reduction in intellectual functioning, IQ between 20 to 80, Hadola, uh, coarse facial appearance, gonadal hypoplasia as a rule. So this is XXXY, so you have three X's, the greens, and one red, the Y, and 18 is the blue, so you have two 18's. Again, the same year, you may have 49 X uh, quadruple Y. Um, Penifacial dysmorphism, testicular abnormality, development delay, low abnormal intelligence. So this is the هذا هو التلخيص اللي حكيناه كله so far.